come down for a little walk down by the park and just went to park over the other side of the park and it is absolutely jam slammed with people so I come down this side and there is no problem parking whatsoever yeah. excellent all right so i'm going to do another touch of video sun right in the lens it and that water looks cold big shelf of ice down both sides of the river that's where it gets dangerous all right i'm heading on down that way there we go that's better all right this is a nice spot Many, many years ago, the bridge that was here before, you could jump off here and there was like a big hole in the ground. And uh, you could uh, jump off there and dive in the water. You can't anymore because when we had the floods, they reshaped all this. Right. Yeah, that ice looks like you could walk across it, but I wouldn't because it's got water on top of it. <laughs> it was minus 28 yesterday, it's now minus 3 now. That's pretty good. Right, let's move on to the next spot. So a little bit down by the bridge. Of course there's no train coming through, never is. Until I get about 500 yards away from it, and it will. You can see the ice is starting to break up in the river here a little bit, it starts to pile up. When the water gets really bad, it will uh, pile up. So I can just see on the ice where the sun is shining. If you look very closely, you can just see the water creeping across the surface. It, uh, that'll set up as a nice layer of ice tonight which is why it's so dangerous because underneath there that could be six inches of water that could be two feet of water no way no if you fall through it you'll soon know but only for about 10 minutes this is actually a very nice walk around i think the rest of calgary had the same idea <laughs> Somebody's dog's not listening. <laughs> right, that'll do for this bit. This is one of my favourite bridges. I like these old uh, truss bridges. Unfortunately, they keep taking them down, replacing them with garbage bridges, as I call them. Slabs of steel, no character to them whatsoever. So, I will do. Ooh, this is quite slippery. So I will do a bit of video across here before they decide to take this one down at some stage. See if I can do this without falling off over it. <laughs> yes, this is a little icy and also considerably windier. Now we've got in the middle of the river. I'm going to get to the round bit in the middle. The ice is breaking up. Let's going to look down here. See, that's what you've got to watch out for. You can get washed underneath that ice. That's it. Aim under. Okay, Aim over. Yeah. Nice. Excellent. Oh, alright Right, let's do the right across the bridge. And there it was. <laughs> That'll do for now. Well, that was a bit of a slippery walk down that path. Hello duck. That is a bit cold. Right, let's get through the bushes here. If I can get a video over towards the bridge that we come over just now. That can't, either way. 
river's flowing good. Right, do another bit in here. That's the bridge I just come over. Train bridge. Cold, cold, cold. Actually, it's only, I say cold, it's only about minus three, minus two, I guess, today. And uh, yesterday was minus 28 with the wind chill. <laughs> Changes fast. Eh? And tomorrow, I think it's going back to minus 25. So. so the weather's warm enough today for everybody to get out and about and ice skate. It was a bit cold yesterday, but today's looking a lot better. People come boating down through here in the summer and ice skating in the winter. And they head down underneath the, the bridge. And that takes them out to the lagoon. There's a lot of people out there. I'll do some video out there in a minute. Yeah, that's got to be a good plan, eh? Got to be a good plan. Yeah, well, we've got a lot of people down here skating. That's what you call a lot of people. And got the fires going over there too, so that's nice. This would be me, with a little frame here, something falling over. There's a lot of people. Sunshine feels very nice. Let's we'll see why everybody's out. Right. Get that up through the trees. There's a lot of people enjoying the sunshine and the ice. Some campfires up there too. Good smell of fire smoke up through here. the uh, ice track set up in the park as well uh, made it in a big loop this year because last year it was a bit of a uh, people kept bumping into each other going back and forth but this year this is the end of the loop <laughs> Somebody. make it look easier somebody told me once if you can uh, ski you can skate well, I can ski really good but I cannot skate skate like Bambi yeah. uh, looks like they've set it up as a one-way system which is good that way I haven't got lots of people crashing into each other these little kids quite amazing how they do this yeah. a good day. No, it's nice and quiet in the park up this end. The other end is really really busy. It's funny enough none of the fire pits up here are being used. Long way to lug wood. But <laughs> be a good spot. There's loads and loads of fire pits down in here which is a good thing. Squeaky snow. Suns are going to be down behind those trees in a minute. So. 
that's going to get pretty cold. Well, the, the new bridge is coming on. The one above me is the original bridge. And they're adding another bridge. Right alongside it. I think they're only leaving the one walkway though. You wouldn't need two walkways. There's the other bridge running parallel. Yes, very nice bridge. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be canoeing down there. Come down there and a kayak and tip over. That would not make a good day. No. Quite amazing how they get that piece to stay out there, eh? <laughs> Gotta make sure you got the balance right. The river's looking good though. Nice to see so many people out enjoying the day. But... Ooh, look at that. <laughs> video from this side because suddenly there's a drop in a number of people and that's the last gap that there is. Busy busy work side there. Eh? The path used to turn off to the left here and go up around in a loop so they built this temporary path while they're doing all the bridge work and stuff. a lot of yellow balls <laughs> not even going to get into that right that'll do for now right the other side of the bridge as you can see there's the old bridge new bridge they did wonder why they, when they built the bridges above me why they only put two lanes in each direction now I know why so we'll have four lanes in each direction across there. That'll be kind of cool. That road can get pretty busy. It goes from Stony Trail, which is three or four lanes in each direction. What about there? Perfect. Very nice.